Hi viewers, welcome to Ganesh K YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I am going to explain you how to create U Vault in Tecla structures, just like this. Okay, let's start. Open your Tecla structures with US environment. Now we are going to create beam. So click on Street and select this beam, and pick the first point and pick the second point to create beam, like this. Now right click on mouse interrupt. Now we are going to place the U Vault. 2 feet away from this beam so let's take reference point so click on edit and click on here and select this at any position point and click on here right click on interrupt now we're going to move this point 2 feet away from this end of this beam so drag and select this point then right click on mouse move special linear you need to move in x direction you can see now we have the x coordinate in this direction now we need to move in opposite direction so let's take here minus two feet then click on move okay right click on mouse interrupt now we're going to place u volt at this location from end of this beam at the bottom of this flange so go to application components by using the shortcut control f or you can click on here in search bar type u volt Okay, you need to type here U volt and scroll it down. You can see now we have the U volt component at this location. So select this component and pick the main part as a, this beam and pick the position at here to create U volt exactly two feet away from this end of this beam, like this. Now close this window, right click on mouse, interrupt, click on space, right click on mouse, redraw view. Use the shortcut control tool. You can see. Now have U board like this. Use a shortcut Control R, and you can rotate like this. Okay. Now we're going to edit this bolt size and shape. So double click on this U bolt. You will get this window like this. Now we can change this depth of this U bolt from this location. For example, by default we have two inch. Let's take here 3 inch and click on modify. You can see now length increased. Similarly, you can increase the distance between the two bolts. For example, by default, we have the 3 and off. Let's take here 4 inch, then click on modify. You can see now the space between these two U shape bolts increased. You can change this projection also. For example, let's take here 1 inch, then click on modify. You can see now we have the projection 1 inch from top of flange to here. For example, let's Let's rotate it like this. You can see now the top of flange to end of this bolt should be one inch. Let's take here 1.5 inch, then click on modify. Select this bolt, then click on modify to see the update like this. Now, from this option, hole tolerance, you can enter the hole tolerance at this location. By default, we have 1 by 16. If you want to increase, you can increase from this option. Now go to Parts tab. In parts, you can control the, this bolt size. By default, we have the half inch. For example, if you want to increase, let's take here 3 by 4 inch. Then click on modify. Now this bolt size should be 3 by 4 inch. No need to change the nut profile and washer profile. By default, uh, according to this size, the nut and washer profiles also change according to this option. For example, let's take 1 inch. Then click on modify. You can see bolt and as well as nut and washer size also increased okay for example let's take here 3 by 4 inch then click on modify like this if you want to place nut and washer at the bottom use the shortcut control 4 for render view and use use the shortcut control r and you can rotate like this if you want to place nut and washer at the bottom of this flange then click on picture tab and you need to you can see the bottom nut and washer by default we have no if you click on s and then click on modify you will get nut and washer at the bottom of flange like this then click on modify apply okay right click on mouse interrupt click on space right click on mouse to draw you can see you'll get u bolt like this okay that's it about how to create U-Volt in Tecla structures. 
If you like this video, please like it and share it. If you have any doubts, please comment below. For more tech love structure related videos, please go to my channel. YouTube.com slash SK. I will provide this link in the description below of this video. Please go through it and come here. Under videos, you can find out so many tech love structure related videos. I hope these videos might be helpful to you. And at the top right corner, please click on subscribe button. If you subscribe, you will get notification or updates when uploading a new video. So please click on subscribe. Okay, thank you.